Hello everyone, this is Ashwin speaking on behalf of VisitTemples.com and today I am here to take you all to one of the beautiful temples that is located in a beautiful place. Come, let's get into the video. Today, I am here to take you all to Sri Sri Govindaji Temple that is located in the state capital of Manipur, Impal. This is one of the largest Vaishnava temple that is located in Manipur. The presiding deity of this temple is none other than Lord Govindaji, who is an incarnation of Lord Mahavishnu. He blesses his devotees visiting this temple along with his consort Radha. On the either side of the Sanctum Sanctorum, we can find the idols of Lord Krishna, Lord Balabhadra, Lord Jagannath and Subhatra. This temple complex was originally built in the year 1846 during the reign of Maharaja Nara Singh. This temple complex was again reconstructed in the year 1876 by the Maharaja Chandrakirti. Initially, this temple complex was maintained and administered by the kings of royal family of Manipur. As per the Article 2 of Manipur merger agreement in of 1949. As per many people's demand, this temple is currently maintained by a board of members which is selected by the priestly community. Now the current president of this board of members is none other than the chief minister of state of Manipur. Temple complex and the idols inside this temple got destroyed since this temple witnessed a huge damage due to an earthquake because of which this temple was reconstructed by Rana Chandrakirti on 26th April 1876. However, during Anglo-Manipur War in 1891, the idols of the temple were moved to Kogma. In the year 1908, Chatur Singh became the Maharaja of Manipur. Only after that, the idols were brought back to this original temple complex. Huge temple complex is built on a sprawling campus surrounded with lush green grasses and tall trees. The temple also has a small pond in its vicinity. Mahashtami, Radhayatra, Basanta Pournami, Kartika Pournami, Holi are celebrated in a grand manner. During this time, thousands of devotees visit this temple from far-flung areas in order to get the blessings of Lord Govinda. I hope the video about this temple was interesting and informative. Please do like, share and comment and do not forget to hit the subscribe and bell button in order to get our divine updates instantaneously. Thank you. Have a great day.